All right, beautiful people, we are back for another box of Raging Raw. My first unboxing was actually pretty sweet. Got some nice hits in there, but I still feel like we could get something even juicier. So yeah, without further ado, let's just rip into these and get the ball rolling. <laughs> All right. Oof. Okay, there's something Mmm, something shiny back there already. Hmm, is this first pack magic? Hmm, all right, let's see. All right, Barbity, Topo. Actually, I don't know why in the cards his name is Topo, but in the anime, his name is just Top. So, don't know why they've done that. Sharpener. Sun Goat 10, Raditz. Is this gonna be a hit? No! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> True first pack magic here, people. You just cannot get better than this. And what do I get? But none other than the Prince of All Saiyans, Vegeta SR Altart. Oh my goodness. When I saw that shine, I seriously was not expecting anything. I thought it was maybe just an awesome SR, but damn boy, you took me by surprise there. Oh my goodness, this is stunning too. Damn, okay. <laughs> we started off extremely strong in this second box. Maybe, maybe this second box, no, that's got to be an SR. Um, yeah, maybe this second box is going to really come through with some bangers. I mean, it's already started off with something truly epic. So, okay, so that's an SR Altart. So yeah, I am hoping that this will be more of a regular box where there's another SR Altart and something else. Okay, so SR Videl, that was the last card. Okay, third pack in, let's just, Let's just fly through this, people. <laughs> All right. Yamu. Spaceship of Hope. Did I? No, I didn't skip a card. Burbles. <laughs> Videl. Dol Tucky. Oh, man. That guy. Such a creep. <laughs> Dispo. Oh, there's a code. <laughs> I don't mind Dispo too, but I think I'm just biased because I just... I love rabbits. Anything rabbit related, I love. So yeah, I liked um, Dispo as well, even though he wasn't really that um, prevalent in the Tournament of Power. Just as soon as I saw that there was a rabbit in it, I was like, oh, yes! <laughs> okay, what's this? Fourth pack in now. No, I don't think there's anything in this pack. Okay, Kabido. Vegeta, oof, baby. Dr. Mew. Double Cannon Maximum. I love that card, Vegeta Childhood. Bulma. Barb... Barbity? Bibbity Barb... Barbity? Yeah, it's Barbity, right? <laughs> oh, Sun Gohan Youth. That's Bibbity. That one was Barbity. And then we got... We have to finish it off with a Boo, right? Surely. Nope, we finished it off with an SR Vegeta. Oh, Son Goku Childhood, that's such a cute card as well. <laughs> Actually, speaking of the Saiyans, um, you guys probably already know this, but it was something new that I learned over the weekend, where the word Saiyan is actually an anagram of the word Yasai, which means vegetable in Japanese. So that is why all of the Saiyans have... Um, yeah, vegetable type names like, you know, Goku is actually Kakarot, which is carrot. Vegeta, obviously, um, vegetable. Nappa is like Nappa cabbage, um, which is Chinese cabbage. There's, yeah, th there's so many like that. Bardock is um, uh, bur burdock root. So, yeah, there's there's a whole bunch of them. I can, <laughs> I can go into detail um about that in maybe another video if you guys are interested but i'm sure you all probably know <clears throat> what the 
vegetables are that are associated with all of the Saiyan names. But yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. It just made me wonder if um, Akira Toriyama was maybe a vegetarian or if he just really loved his vegetables to, to go in that direction of just naming them all after vegetables. But yeah, I thought that was pretty neat. Okay, great say, man. <laughs> Sun Gohan. Tapa. Pin. Majin Buu. Double Cannon Maximum. That was actually a cool thing that they did in the Tournament of Power as well. Nakum. Oops. New Legend. Vegeta. And Legic. If you guys are also opening this set, let me know how you are finding it. So far, I've I've been enjoying it and I would love to hear if you guys are getting any epic pulls as well. You can either comment on the video or just hit me up on Instagram either way but yeah definitely love um, sharing all of the hits that's always really really fun and it does seem that getting that super altar even though it's pretty rare I don't know I do tend to find that it will come up in my Instagram feed quite a bit once the set is released. So not just with this one, but with the other ones from Awakened Pulse and Blazing Aura. So it does make me think maybe it's not, I mean, I think it's pretty rare, but it's not unattainable, if you know what I mean. Like, I don't think you have to sink in too much money to get it from a box or a case, but yeah, it still would be so amazing to pull it nonetheless. But yeah, I feel like getting a Master's God Rare would just be, yeah, on another level. I think that rarity is maybe more than the super old arts from Fusion World. But again, if I'm wrong about that, please let me know in the comments below. Okay, Topa or Top, Napa. Scouter, Majin Buu, Majin Buu again, Bardock, Raditz, all the vegetables, <laughs> Sun Goku, Hercule, Bulma GT, and the code. I like that there's more Bulma cards in this set as well. I think with Blazing Aura there was only the SR and the SR Altar. I don't recall really many others or maybe there was that one where she's holding the dessert or maybe that was that might have been from Awaken Pulse actually I don't remember but it's nice to see that there's yeah all these different um Bulma cards and like different versions of her as well so yeah pretty sweet my collection of Bulma cards is actually growing very nicely so yeah I can't wait to um get some more and have them all maybe displayed in the background or something but yeah they're mostly the Super Dragon Ball Heroes Japanese cards because they make some really really beautiful cards especially Bulma cards so yeah I can't <laughs> I can't wait to collect more and get all that organized and obviously collect more Gohan cards as well and just, yeah, even just buying more sets and just trying to pull some god rares. That would be absolutely epic. Alright. Oops. Weiss. Days of Training. It's <laughs> cute. Para Para Brothers. Special Beam Cannon. Sun Gohan GT and the code. Hmm, okay. So we started off very strong with that SR altar. We might be halfway through now. I'm still waiting for another hit. And I don't think I've even opened any packs that have a leader on the front. So I hope that doesn't mean that they're gonna all be at the bottom and then like the, the end of the box is like pretty dead. But we'll see. Great, same man. Kepler. Sun Goku, Sealed Margin, Tulu, Bulma, <laughs> Sun Goku, and Top 
or Topo SR. Oh, and speaking of, we have a leader pack. <laughs> so definitely nothing in here, but I'll go through it anyway. And I hope this speed is okay for you guys because yeah, I know that some of my other unboxings are a bit long and I know everyone is so busy nowadays. So I am trying to make these a bit quicker, but at the same time, I don't want to go so fast that you guys can't enjoy the cards or the video. So yeah, let me know if this speed is okay for you guys. Okay, we got the farmer. <laughs> Oh, that's so funny that they made a card for him. Like, is he even going to be very playable in the game? Because he's only got a power level of five? <laughs> Probably not. Uh, although then again, it could be one of those things where you are matching the energy level of your opponent, but then you just need something just a little bit to get over and win. Who knows? Oh, oh! SC! Ah, oh my gosh. Wow, okay, I did not see that coming. <laughs> Sorry for swearing, guys. I got uh, caught off guard, obviously. But, wow, that is actually beautiful. Look at that rainbow shine and that texture. What a thing of beauty. Oh my goodness. All right, so if we got a SCR and we have an SR alt art, we should get one more SR alt art somewhere in this pack. Okay, Eraser, Macarita, I think that's how you say it. Vegeta, Childhood, Sun, Goku, Sphere of Destruction, Bulma, Oof. New Legend, oh, Gregory. Gregory is so cute as well. <laughs> so random, but you know, so cute. Android 17, Bardock SR. Okay, I think I saw some shine back here too, but it didn't look too crazy, so it's probably just an SR. Yeah, if there's anything that I've learned from opening Fusion World is that if there's just a normal shine. Ah, yep, yep, see, so Sun Goku SR. Okay, cool, I don't have this one yet actually. Oh damn, look at that. The way that they made that texture different to the rest of the card. So beautiful. So glad that they're doing that in Fusion World. But yeah, if it's just a normal shine like that, it's probably just an SR. But if it's a rainbow shine, if it's got that rainbow shimmer effect, it's definitely something juicier than that. Okay. <laughs> I think we're going to start hitting all the leader cards now. All right. Kami. Pan, Spopovich, Vito, Majin Buu, Piccolo, Saiyaman, Yakon, <laughs> Trunks Future, and the Code. Okay, so this is what I mean. See how you can just see this iridescent rainbow shine? So I think there is a hit in this pack. I am, it looks like it could be that SR Ulta Margin Buu card that I pulled in my first box. So I'm actually hoping that it's not that card because I only have four boxes, so I, I really don't want any duplicates. But we'll see. Son of Gohan, Chilled, Bubbles, Kunchi. Oh yeah, there's definitely something back here, people. Oh, yes! Yes, something different! <laughs> Sun Goku SR Ultar. Damn, that's nice. Alright, I'm pretty happy with this. I actually did want this one as well. So, oh shit, so happy with that. Okay, so we've already gotten our hits in the box. That's pretty much it, but <laughs> let me just show you what's left in the few packs that I have left. Vegeta. Piccolo, Sun Goten, Days of Training, Zo Zoe Ray. I forget how to say that character. I barely even remember that character, to be honest. Oh, Majin Buu SR. Very nice. And as suspected, the leader cards are probably in the, <laughs> the packs towards the end of the box. But that's fine. It kind of, you know... Um, 
lets the hits come first and then you can just know, okay, there's nothing left in the box so you can just go a bit quicker. Trunks GT, Metacool, ooh, Metacooler Core. Actually looks pretty sick. All right. After this, we have our last pack as well. Definitely not gonna be anything in there, but I, again, I don't really keep uh, count of the SRs as I pull them. So there could be maybe one more, I think, but we'll see. All right, here we go. Last pack, the cheetah with a mustache. <laughs> I swear in GT with that whole look, he looks like Freddie Mercury. No, no joke. <laughs> with the jeans and the singlet and the mustache. Oh man, <laughs> it's pretty funny. All right, speaking of Vegeta, oh, okay. So we ended with a rare, not an SR, but that is totally fine. We got a pretty nice box, I have to say. Let's quickly look at everything once more before we wrap things up. So we've got a SR Majin Buu, SR Alt Art Sun Goku. Love that one, actually. The regular Sun Goku SR. Bardock, SCR Sun Goku GT, very, very nice. Topo, Sun Goku GT, Vegeta, and the Vegeta SR Altar. I think maybe this might actually be my favorite one from this box. But yeah, there you have it, people. That was everything for the second box of Raging Raw. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one.